Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, bear with me. Sorry for being a little late. I'm normally earlier than this with your weekly. This is your weekly reading for the week of the 1st to the 7th of July. Bear with me. I'm trying my best to bring you your messages. Yeah? Vibe with me. Vibe with me, Capricorn, Taurus. Virgo, spirit of the highest vibration of unconditional love. Can I have two recent past messages for Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo? Two recent past messages for Capricorn, Taurus, a Virgo. Two recent past messages for Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Spirit of the highest vibration of unconditional love. Can I have energy readings for Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo for the week of the 1st to the 7th of July? Energy readings for Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo for the week of the 1st to the 7th of July. Advice, can I have spread of the highest vibration of unconditional love? Can I have two advice for Capricorn Taurus Virgo for the week of the 1st to the 7th of July? Two advice for Capricorn Taurus Virgo for the week of the 1st to the 7th. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Uh, vibe with me. So we have the death card for recent past. We have the page of wands. And we have um, the ten of cups. So recently you have had transformation taking a, um, occurrence in your life. Change. Old ways, new ways. You know, change from old things, new, new things. Just transforming transforming of you and what how you do things and what you do you've possibly taken some form of passionate action recently or business action or you could be passionate about your business Poss you've possibly even taken an adventure recently yeah or thinking about taking a act some form of passionate action or adventure or business action yeah that's possible you could be um 
You could be thinking about making a commitment. Your action could be towards a connection, a, a commitment, yeah? It's possible that um, you have committed, <laughs> oh, that sounds weird. You have joined in a serious relationship recently. It's possible that um, things has gotten more harmonious for you with your family, friends, and those in your environment, yeah? More ad harmonious and um, realistic and practical. Sorry about that Capricorn Taurus Virgo. My um, phone battery, um, not battery, my, I didn't realize the week has been so intense. I didn't realize that I didn't um, delete my previous videos. So yeah, we've had the debt card recently, the page of wands and the um, ten of cups, you know, fulfillment, happy life. Happy changes re recently, transformation recently, change recently, you know, happy life. Um, your happiness spilling over to other persons, to you. Unity, acknowledgement recently, thinking of making a passage, passionate decision recently. Or um, may have made a passionate um, decision or action recently. So Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. For the week of the 1st to the 7th of July, we have the 5 of Cups, we have the 3 of Cups, we have the King of Cups, and we have the Queen of Swords, we have the um, 4 of Pentacles, and we have the Emperor. So, for some of you, you might have some form of loss or disappointment, but remember... There is um, two cups at the back of the, the behind you. Just hold up your head and look around. All is not lost. Or you might have some change from what you've been losing recently. Yeah. And uh, you might have some celebration or a choice to make in love. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. You might have some celebration with yourself or your friends. Beginning this week, the 1st to the 7th of July. Or a choice to make some friend um a choice to make in love yeah or trees a crowd if you're not making any choice you might be in love with a um pisces cancer or scorpio they might be in love with you or both of you might be in love with each other or you make might make an offer to someone who is just any other sign that is just affectionate loving caring creative sensitive empathic possibly intuitive positive possibly psychic so you might have celebration from some form of loss you've had. You might now celebrate it. You might up from that celebration. You might have some form of offer coming in or going out. So um, you might have to um speak your truth about some form of loss you've experienced. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. You might have a um Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra coming in in your life. Either um, in personal relations or, you know, intimate relations or a new phase with this person, a change from some form of loss with this person, you might um, have to speak your truth um, for some of you. Might have to cut off what's no longer in alignment with you or serving you and, might, and you might make some form of communication this week, the 1st or the 7th. So um, you might... Get some form of promotion or a lot of money coming in than you're used to or much more than you've been having. You might have a connection that you're not letting go of or someone is not letting go of you or being possessive. Or there's just a connection that you hold dear to you or they hold dear to you dear, that dear to them, yeah? You might, um, you might be finding financial stability this week yeah or being at a better place yeah you might have celebration because of that financial stability that you're finding or increase in money or um job um promotion or a new position a new job so um you might have to choose between someone who is very loving and caring and um protective 
and um more stern and less of an emotional person to someone who is more of an emotional person yeah you might have to um you might you might have someone who is very protective and loyal and um straightforward and experienced coming in to help you as a friend a male or it could be a female it's not for certain yeah or you might have to choose between characters who are less emotional and more emotional but experience both persons yeah or you just might be joining alliances with these different characteristics or you taking on these roles capricorn taurus virgo yeah so you might have some fast action coming in some um spiritual help you know some spiritual understanding from aries leo or sagittarius or you might be taking on this fast mod, um career minded energetic um spiritual persona or you might just have to um make a decision about this person or they might be helping you with something or you might just be collaborating with each other you might feel like you're end up at the end of your rope you know feeling tired of being um stabbed in the butt back tired of um being the martyr for others you know capricorn taurus virgo you might um feel it overburned yeah and you this if you're feeling it now or you're having a change from this you might have a change from this or even if you don't have a change from it as yet it is dried around the bend you notice there's darkness there but the light is coming out so you might have a decision capricorn taurus virgo to make with a lover or lovers you might have a decision to make um, between lovers you might have a decision to make between a Gemini you might uh, um, with a Gemini you might um, be divinely connected to a person to um, you know collaborate with or have a spiritual union with and um, have a spiritual journey and intimate journey with so yeah Capricorn Taurus Virgo that's your reading Thank you very much for watching. I bid you the highest, highest, highest vibration and healing, healing, healing and protection, of course, and peace.